So we're gonna talk about the Ohio State and Michigan game. Mm. <laughs> you ready? Let's get it. Yeah, let's go, nigga. How you feel today, man? Yesterday, you know, the whole Buckeye Nation is is is. Man, is, man I can't believe we lost that fucking game. <laughs> and the whole Buckeye Nation can't. You know man, what I mean? Like, dude, like McCord is not a good quarterback. But, man, they try to build him up, man. Oh, he had two seventy-one, two touchdowns, two picks. You know, man, but he telegraphs. The whole time, he passes the ball. I'm trying to be calm about this because I'm really fucking bad. <laughs> I'm really pissed Slash off. is hot. I'm pissed, bro. <laughs> I'm trying to be calm because when I get mad, it, 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 it's not nothing nice. <laughs> but, McCorp, you are fucking trash, bro. You are fucking trash. Let's give him a little bit of credit. Man, man. fuck that nigga. <laughs> Bro, you telegraphs every time you pass the ball. Every time you pass it to a person, you can tell where the ball is going. <laughs> like, like, bro, I'm just saying, like. Oh, man, you know, I'm man. weak right bro, now, man. Bro, like, this nigga, man, he's and, fucking um, trash, bro. And, 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 you know, like like I said, he's been doing it all season, man. It's like nobody, I don't know how they address yeah, it, coach yeah. and staff. I don't know what goes on, man, but man. that's all I keep seeing. You know, I keep, uh, you know, kept seeing all season long is, you know, how he's watching what receiver he's going to throw the ball to. Yeah. And that, that last pick, everybody in that stadium, mm -hmm. whoever watched that game, knew who he was going to go to. Yeah. You know what I mean? And you like, as soon as he hiked the ball, his eyes was on. It's like he don't understand the play. You know what I'm saying? Like, not it's like, like, like I would say like C.J. Stroud. He's yeah. a, you know, he knows the playbook, he knows what receiver is going to do what. Yeah. So if he's going to go left, he know he can look right and wait for his receiver to hit his route, pull that safety over, boom, hit his mm -hmm. receiver. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, and I get, it. you know, um, McCord is a college quarterback, whatever, but you had, what, 12 games to get this right. And you haven't, you know, begin. And I don't really want to um, put all the blame on McCord because the, the receiver before that, that caught that pass for Ohio State, and they ruled it a uh, fumble. It could have been an incomplete pass. Like, he yeah, caught yeah, the yeah. ball, and, you know, the defender knocked it out of his hand, and it was a fumble. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? That could have any. That could have just as well become an incomplete pass. But because... Yeah. Do you hear music? Yeah. Playing the Bee Gees or something. This is all... <laughs> hey, <laughs> man, this time, is happening like, every week, man. Like, what's up with this, man? It's, every time. Is, Playing the Bee Gees. Yeah, I'm gonna have to figure out what's going on, man. But um, I have lost my train of thought and everything. Man. Yeah. I just heard music. I about to start dancing. <laughs> <laughs> start doing the disco. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Man. Like, but um, but you know, it could have went anyway. You know, that could have been a determining factor of that game too. If he yeah. wouldn't, you know what I'm saying. You know, and, but McCord, he he telegraphs. You know, what I mean, and, and some of the play calling. You know, it's been kind of, you know, like, like I don't even know, even with that little bit of time, you know, why they were going to the middle of the field anyway. If anything, you know, why not have um, um, uh, Harris go, um, what's his name, man? Marvin Harrison, Marvin Harrison go out to an out route. And you know what I mean? And the thing about it, like, when McCord got hit, he held the ball way too long. For one, he they knew where he was going. That, that's his other problem. Yeah, you, you know, like the pressure was coming. You know, what I'm saying throw that ball. Like you know, like Harrison is a player. You don't throw two. You throw at and let him go make a yeah, play. He's yeah, one of yeah. those like to me remind me of Randy Moss. Just throw the ball. There's been a couple of times where McCourt threw the ball up to him, and Marvin Harrison yeah, wouldn't went up and go back. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying. So you got 12 games with the dude. You practice every day. How come you don't know that? And I and, and I, I I get it. It's not easy being a quarterback. You don't know what's going to happen when you say. Huh? You know what I'm saying? But, you know, clearly he held that ball way too long. I was looking too, like, throw it, man. When they hit him, the ball was short. It got picked off game. Bro, like, I watched, when I was watching the game, I seen a couple wide open receivers he could have passed the ball to. All throughout the game? All throughout the game. But, of course, he's looking at Marvin Harris. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because, he, okay, Marvin Harrison is a beast. We all know that. But you can't you can't look at a receiver like that. You gotta know you gotta know how to look them safeties off. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, you know, you look when if Marvin Heaven's going for an out route and you know that. Mm -hmm. Look at the tight end. Look at somebody else. You yeah. know what I'm saying? It's like like and I always take that last play because I watch that clear as day. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn, this nigga is looking right at her. This is his face. Hi. You know, it was like he watching the whole route. From he watched him from on the line, like he was looking at him like this. Hi. 
washed in all the way around, you know what I mean? Like no looked at nobody else, you know what I'm saying? No check down, nothing. It was just, and I get the rush was coming and stuff yeah, like yeah, that, but yeah. get rid of that ball. If you know his route, if you watch him, get rid of that ball two seconds earlier, you know what I'm saying? He got hit, ball game, you know what I'm saying? Like, My thing is like if Marvin Harrison was getting doubled on the line, I mean, somebody was Some, open. Somebody's open. Somebody's on one-on-one. -on -one, you know hey, what I mean? Look on, around. Man, yeah. Like, this is what I'm saying about... Like, I was arguing with my brother's dude the whole time about McCord when we was watching the I'm game. I'm going to say pause. That kind of sound a little gay, though. Right? I mean... My brother's dude. Okay, pause, nigga. <laughs> we ain't about to start that pause you know stuff, man. My, my brother's homie. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, we was... Because, like, at the beginning of the game, oh, we goodness. was both talking about McCord. And we like, I'm telling him like, man, McCord is not that dude. He's he's yeah. not a good quarterback. He like, he he got to warm up. He got to warm up by the second half. Yeah, he always played better, but they, we need a quarterback that can play good right out yeah, the yeah, gate. Out the gate, yeah. And that's what that's another thing I've been saying about Ohio yeah. State, man. Like you you playing your sorry teams or lower level teams, and you only have 13 zip at the half, man. Yeah. Like like, come on, man, you can't get another touchdown. Like something's wrong with that. Like I say, like even with Ohio State having a good defense. What's going to happen when you play against a good offense that can score on good defenses Defense, yeah. and you're not scoring? You know, it's going to cause a problem. Mm -hmm. And that's something that I, you know, like people don't want to – like a lot of the Buckeye Nation, not all of them, but a lot of these arrogant fans, and I'm going to say a lot of these arrogant fans – don't want to face the facts, the real truth about what the, you know, the flaws of a mm -hmm. team. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. you know, like if you're a true Buckeye fan, you shouldn't know what the flaws is of your team. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. acknowledge that. Like, it's not even blame the coach and, you know, oh, now we're going to call firing the coach. Like, you can't fire a coach. I don't give. I don't care about it being. I was about to cuss. I'm trying not to cuss. <laughs> I don't care about it being a rival team, but this coach has got a winning record. He's mm -hmm. only three against Michigan. He's going to get one soon. Like, how State can't win them all all the time? Mm -hmm. Times change. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we, like, well, we did beat them like 10 times in a yeah, row. Yeah, you know what I mean? So yeah. Michigan was at some point going to start winning. You know, yeah. that's just how it is. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You don't win at all. So, you know, let's fire the coach. We ain't like him in the beginning. Isn't that? Yeah, y'all some assholes, man. Y'all some jerks. You know what I'm saying? You're not mm -hmm. true fans. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? You, you know what I mean? And, you know, yeah, and that's why I like, I, I, I like. I'm a fan of the sport, but I'm not a Buckeye because I'm, I don't want to be a part of that, that fan base of people, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, like, you know, just arrogant and just, just stupid, you know what I mean? Just want to blame, you know, don't blame the coach. Your coach mm -hmm. is coach, players play. Yeah, yeah. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, like, coach called a play, and then it's fault that the quarterback threw a pick. You know what I mean? You know, so stuff like that. So, you know, yeah, but um, I've been talking a lot. You got any other say so you want to say on it no, so no no and then also i, I believe also too all oh, yeah house stage run game ain't really been all that good you know what i mean so but i mean it was a good game man i, I was really on my edge of the seat watching like come on y'all can do okay you know mm -hmm. he i mean I, I give some credit you know especially with notre dame that last you know two minute drive and they came back one i mean you know i've seen him you know you know complete some passes and he was doing it in that game in that last drive and complete yeah. some passes man it's just you know, like, at this point in the season, you should be better at what you do at quarterback. You should kind of have that offense down to a, a science. You yeah. should kind of know that Michigan is going to come at you. your team, man. Yeah, so. you know what I mean? Like, you know, and so, but, yeah, man, but y'all let us know, man. How'd y'all feel about uh, that game, man? Um, you know, whose fault was it? Let me let us know. Comment down below. Whose fault was the that it at Ohio State was the coach's fault. Let us know. Comment down below. And do y'all think McCoy is a good quarterback or not? Because I don't. I don't think he is at all. So. <laughs> He's on Jimmy Butler's level. <laughs> <laughs> he might be he lower than Jimmy Butler, dude. man. Because like, all that telegraphing getting on my nerves, bro. All right, man. Well, y'all stay tuned, man. We'll be back with a little NFL. It's my word to the fans.